Hi Cancer, welcome to your love reading. This is going to be for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Venus and Rising. This is a general love reading so it may or may not resonate. If it doesn't resonate with you, feel free to check your other placements. So we're going to look at you and your person's energy towards each other first and then we'll look at your overall love life. So let's see what's going on with Cancer and the person they're thinking about. Cancer and their person, what are the energies? Okay. Oh. Okay, someone you've been having conflict with may want to apologize or say something with a page of cups. It seems that... I'm hearing this. <laughs> I'm hearing love and war, and that's exactly what it is here. So you guys have had some arguments, or you recently had an argument. They want to apologize. They want to make peace. I'm hearing peace offering too. So they might they might buy you something, or they bought you something. I see that you are thinking about the situation with this person. Whatever happened in the past, you may kind of find yourself thinking about it, and. You may be talking to people. Either some of you have other options, another option, or you may have been talking to friends or this person's friends or family about what happened, about the situation. Mutual energy. Both of you are, are defensive here. Both of you are defensive, indecisive as well. Some of you have made the decision to kind of be distant. I feel Cancer may be trying to get answers through other people or figure out how this person is doing from the people they know. Um, we have the Hermit here in reverse. Hold on, let me fix this mic. Okay, the Hermit in reverse, it could be dealing with a Virgo. In the near future, I do see an offer. I feel, Kenta, that your shell, you, can, you know, you're going to go into your shell or you have already. Because I see you kind of pushing someone away here. You may, be, you may be peeking your head out of this shell. You're having a real Kenta moment. You may feel like going towards this person, then pull back. I feel like you need more from them. You need to see more interest from this person. But it's definitely to do with some kind of issue, something that happened, but this person does want to apologize. They have something to say. Let's see. What do we have for cancer when it comes to love? What does Cancer need to know right now when it comes to their love life? What does Cancer need to know right now when it comes to their love life? Cancer, you got this card that Leo usually gets. <laughs> the Magician in Reverse. This tells me you're fronting, Cancer, and I feel like it's just you trying to protect your heart. But you may be fronting like you don't want this person. Because they've hurt you, Ten of Swords. Hurt me again, so you have, you have withdrawn, you're going to your shell. You feel betrayed, hurt by this person, and they are in their feelings too. Queen of Cups in reverse. This person is, they're upset too. They're upset. You feel like this, you, you feel like they're the devil, like the devil card isn't here, but you, you're seeing them as a seven of swords. So you, you feel like they are the ones who, you know, cause you pain. Ten of Wands is what's blocking here. We also have them seeing you as a Three of Wands. They may feel like you're looking elsewhere for love or that you're waiting for them, waiting to see what they do. 
Definitely with the Wheel of Fortune in reverse, something bad happened. Why is this person feeling the Queen of Cups in reverse towards Cancer? See? Three of Swords, they're heartbroken. Five of Pentacles. You must have shoved this person out. You probably left them out in the cold because they may have hurt your feelings here. They are heartbroken and sad and feeling left out in the cold, Cancer. I feel like you've got into your shell. You're protecting yourself at this moment. What is going on with Cancer when it comes to love? Attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. Deception, someone's wearing a false mask in this relationship. And that could be you, Cancer, even though you got hurt by this person. You do have the magician in reverse. So you may be kind of, you know, angry at this person, telling them you don't want them or making it seem that way. I feel like you just want an apology. At least. True love, this is the romance of a lifetime. We have pay attention to the red flags, the signs are cautioning you. Cautioning you. Yeah. So, if this is something you don't want to deal with, then this could be a red flag. Like them saying harsh things, hurting your feelings, could be a red flag. That's probably why you're not going straight towards them right away and trusting them. But they're definitely heartbroken and missing you. This could be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, because you do have the Queen of Wands upright here. So I was going to say when it said, you know, the red flags, this, if this is a fire sign, fire signs are, are quite harsh for cancer, especially Aries, <laughs> but I feel like that you, they definitely hurt your feelings. Let me get some of these oracle cards. What is going on with cancer and their love situation? Balance. Partnerships and alliances. Three of one. Rest and rejuvenate. Four of swords. So you're definitely taking a break. Awareness. The magician. You are definitely, you definitely withdrawn here. I feel like you can't get over what was said by this person or what was done. Why the Ten of Swords? Clarify the Ten of Swords, please. Okay. This person could have been juggling for some of you that could be what be, what you feel betrayed by them juggling someone else or they could have a child with someone else from the past why the magician in reverse cancer You may feel betrayed, you may feel like this person was the magician in reverse. That could also be the reason why it's here. You feeling like they were not who they said they were, they were playing games or being manipulative. Because this has caused a tower moment for you. Why the Seven of Swords? Goodness. You feel like they may have other options. You feel, some of you feel like they sold you a dream. And you just, <laughs> seven of wands, you keep, you keep wanting to shove this person out, like push him away. Why the three of wands? 
it's so strange because this person wants a new start with you they want something stable they want to leap towards something stable they know that you want something stable and they are feeling heartbroken but you are seeing this person as the worst thing on earth <laughs> the worst i would say it could be true but if you haven't if you like don't know for sure if this person's done anything let's say you only heard that they did something you could be wrong that person could be lying you know could be that's if you that's if you only heard something from someone it may not be true based on what i'm seeing with this person's feelings towards you but if you have your proof and everything then maybe you're right why the queen of wands this person may be really working on their finances busy with work they may have some financial issues or trying to correct something financially i see them being quite busy focused but definitely heartbroken they may be working to get their mind off of this why the two of swords in reverse is the outcome some of you are trying to focus on being single but you're still going to be thinking about the past six of cups in reverse so this may kind of drive you to do your own investigation on this situation find out the truth let's see what we got here what do we have for cancer when it comes to love same thing different day side eye somebody somebody acting like they got amnesia a line of questioning is needed if they brought it to you they're talking about you too again someone could have told you something similar message for i think it was aries with gossip someone someone trying to say your person was doing something and it's like you may have to side eye the person who told you because like what were they saying what's their agenda you know careful if you just heard something because it could be false could be just a hate up let's see baby boom this came out for aries too expecting conceiving soon children involved family tree i don't know if you're dealing with someone who has who is an aries or has aries in their child or you do but it's looking like a similar thing with gossip and, and it was definitely something to do with pregnancy or a child as well i think this card came out too no i think this came out for capricorn so more to the story someone on un, something unknown will be revealed something isn't adding up read between the lines lies deceit and betrayal backstabbing and here we have Someone's wearing a false mask. We have the magician in reverse. There's something fishy going on here. There's something fishy going on here. If you heard something, I feel like it could definitely be a lie. If you heard something, it could be a lie. If you have your proof, then this person could be lying. Someone's lying here, and it doesn't have to be your person. What do we have for Cancer when it comes to love? What does Cancer need to know? Time apart. Fantasy versus reality. That came out for Aries too. Where, you know, someone could be creating a fake fantasy. We do have the Seven of Cups. Either, some, either this person, you feel like this person sold you a dream or someone lied to you about this person and it could be, you know, just to ruin your relationship. Trust and relocating. 
Some of you could be moving. I just, I, I don't know, I'm torn because it's not like I'm seeing your person over here as being bad. So I strongly believe if it's just word of mouth, it's a lie. Tell me more about Cancer's love situation. Give me three cards to explain their person at least. Five of five of ones, jealousy, knight of cups in reverse. Yeah, this is something to do with jealousy, Cancer. If this is someone, if someone told you this, they're lying. There's jealousy involved, Comp competition. Someone's jealous of this relationship. I'm hearing set up as well. Someone could have set up your person or try and make them look guilty. They could have fallen for it or something. Somebody wanted this relationship to start, mo start moving forward. Could even be an ex of yours. There's something fishy going on with this story, just like with the Aries um, reading. Let me see. What's the advice for cancer? Deal with it. Look deeper into the details, cancer. Seriously? Someone's lying here. Someone is lying. Look at this, partnerships and alliances. It could be a group of people getting, getting together to do this, to create a story. Could be this person's baby mom or baby dad or yours, creating a story. There's something fishy going on here, Cancer. You need to, you need to investigate. Do not take anyone's word. We have big changes good reputation There's something fishy going on here cancer this is not what it seems this is this is something to do with jealousy and someone not wanting you to be with someone possibly for some of you it could be that your person is a plain old fake and a liar and a deceiver but I don't see that on their side I see someone who's heartbroken in their feelings, feeling left out in the cold by you. Okay, that's their, that's their emotions. You know, if it was a narcissist, they wouldn't feel no guilt or no heartbreak. And for some of you, it could be, but maybe that's just not, maybe this is not your reading if you are dealing with someone who you caught in something. Because this looks like this person's being lied on. They're being lied about. They're focusing on their money. They probably don't even know that um, someone told this lie. You probably just left them or brought it to them and left them or you haven't told them. But because I'm seeing what they're doing right now is just kind of focus on some some kind of financial issue that they've had that they have they might not even know what's going on or they probably know is that they got dumped cancer this is what i'm seeing I, uh, i'm gonna have to wait till your next reading to see what else <laughs> to see what comes next because this is all i'm getting this is for you to um look deeper into the details like really really look because something isn't adding up here as the card says. You may think it's this person betraying you. It might be some friends of yours or whoever told you this. So I hope this was helpful. There's Cancer Energy. There's Capricorn, Taurus, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Virgo, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Those are the main signs. So feel free to check your other placements. 
subscribe if you're new thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one